I just tried to film this intro again and I took a picture of myself trying to talk. I'll insert it here. <laughs> hey guys, it's Nikki. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel for you. I have no idea what it look. I mean, like the green light, the green camera is like staring me in the face, but I want to look at myself. So if I look a little crazy, it's because I'm, I'm looking at myself. <laughs> but hi guys, how are you? Um, it's Nikki. Whoa, I don't say that but it's Nikki welcome back to my channel welcome to my channel if you're new today's video as you can tell by the title will be a reaction video to the my lash just looks okay to the Doja Cat and Gucci Man song Gucci Mane Nikki get it together the Doja Cat and Gucci Mane song like that um in the intro that I had when it got deleted that I just did um I basically kind of asked for an open conversation and how people were feeling about Doja Cat releasing a music video because I have loved her music um, for a little bit of time now and obviously you know there were some allegations well not even allegations I mean it was, well yeah but it was clear that she was in certain chat rooms and partaking I guess in certain conversations with certain people who are racist and obviously a lot of people had issues with that me as well I mean but she did come out and apologize and she did an Instagram statement and then she went on IG live which I did watch on YouTube because I didn't watch it live because like honestly I don't know I just don't go and look like that like I looked because I saw that apparently this video was coming out and then I saw that leak and I watched it and I was like ooh like she looked good or whatever um and, you know, she addressed everything and she apologized and she addressed her mistakes and said that she wants to be basically make improvements as a person, which I think is the best thing that she could do is make improvements not only to herself, but to also kind of portray that publicly as she's doing it. Because, I mean, like this was something that came out publicly, if you're catching my drift. So um, I just really wanted to know your guys' thoughts and opinions. I think that's what the part that cut out. Um, you're going to just see, it might sound like I'm picking up from a random spot in the next clip, but that's because that was from um, what I had already filmed in the clip that I have. And it would make more sense if the last clip was there, but whatever. Um, but yeah, so I just kind of was, I think I was just explaining a bit of the backstory, which was that, you know, she was found to be part partaking in certain chat rooms that weren't, uh, that were, that had racist people in them and she addressed it all um but i just truthfully didn't expect her to release music so soon um i said this in my outro because i literally just filmed it so if you hear it twice don't say nothing and just be that uh, i'm kind of annoyed but it's okay um i just didn't think she would be releasing anything soon um i'm happy that she's not letting things knock her down and in a sense but also i hope that she's also educating herself and just growing as a person because that's all she can do um because, like, she was really becoming a star. And I'm not saying that she isn't a star because she's super talented, super beautiful, and a talented woman. Um, it's just, you know, it's not like those are mistakes that happened eight years ago, you know, or something like that. Like, they happened, like, two months ago, three months ago. I Don't quote me on the timeline because I don't know. It was 2020. So, um, yeah, but, yeah, I'm going to let me prior to putting on the lashes talk so like don't mind her she's a little off looking um because she needed a lash but now she has a lash as you can see so like we don't judge her without a lash i'm so sorry i'm not looking at you i'm literally looking at myself hold on yeah don't judge me without a lash in this next clip but um i'm just gonna in this next clip you're gonna see me continue con 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 you're gonna in this next clip, you're going to see me continuing on the conversation that I was I started to have with you guys just about um, Doja Cat and what has gone on and everything and things that I was seeing on Twitter and such like that in regards to her dropping a music video. So that is going to be this clip. What was that? Anyways. And saying certain things that were um, racially insensitive. Um, and honestly... When I saw, because I, I think she was trending, and I don't know why it was. This was, like, the other night. Because, truthfully, like, Doja Cat did slowly become one of my favorite artists this year, this past year. And um, I was listening to her since last year, since I think her EP, her album, I don't know, Amala, came out. And then, I'm giving y'all a backstory, like y'all asked. But 
Um, so I was really happy when I heard that she had an album. I didn't listen to it when it first came out. I listened to it at the beginning of this year. Anyways, found it to be fire. Like that is one of my favorite songs that I bump. I used to bump like all the time. And then, you know, <sighs> things came out with just her, you know. And I just want to know from black viewers, black fans, um, black people how they feel right now of Doja Cat and her releasing music or not yeah I think she did release something because when I go, went to go on her Twitter today to see like if she had dropped the video or whatever um, she I think she had put a song on SoundCloud like the other day so I just want to know how you guys feel about that like is like I don't know like yes she's came out she made an apology and then she went on IG live and I watched that live actually like on YouTube I watched the recap of it and watched her ha say what she had to say I just really want to know like what are thoughts and feelings about it as an artist you accept her coming out with a music video and making music still because she's an artist I mean I don't know I don't know I don't know if I necessarily expected her to quit the industry completely like but I didn't think to hear from her for a really long time but she addressed it and then she continued on so I just want to know what are your thoughts and opinions about that just a little bit down below you can let me know um but needless to say I've been a big fan of her music I think in the la the only video that I the only video that I did on my channel in regards to her I think was the in your eyes remix with for your eyes somebody um <laughs> remix from the weekend and her and i think i said i wanted to get her vinyl the album is good i don't know if i'll be doing that because i, I am not sure right now but um i just really enjoy her music as an artist and i was super disappointed to see everything i was happy that she addressed it in the way that she did in regards to the instagram live because it didn't seem like anything was scripted it didn't seem like anything was um you know it just came from her heart and she was just talking as if she was talking to a friend and venting and you know apologizing for something and getting facts straight so i was happy to see that um but like i said i really want to know your guys' opinion down below because you know us as black people are entitled to have our opinions whether you want to support her or not so i really want to know how the black community is really feeling about her let's say releasing this music video and such because i tried to go on some replies and i saw a lot of people supporting it but then again i also did see some negative comments but they were more positive than negative but i don't know if that's through like filtering of the comments or anything um so i, ju I just really want to know because doja i don't think that we can deny she makes great music and i do always think that there's room for improvement and growth and which i think she could be going in the right direction of i mean we all have our mistakes and stuff like that hers were different you know um but yeah let me know like i keep saying just let me know i just want to know and ha be able to have that open conversation no slander of course towards anybody like in the comments but like to be able to have that open conversation but yeah and so i saw her trending the other day because i think this video had got leaked like the entire thing like i thought that it was gonna be like some bs you know sometimes like when you see an artist trending and it's like oh my god okay but it's like a freaking compilation of like old videos and you're like girl new music video where but no let me really like this my shit this my way like oh my gosh and i was like yo that they really done hold on i know y'all can hear noise i'm so sorry so my makeup is everywhere i'm trying to get my laptop situated but I was like, oh my god, they really done, you know, expose the video like that. And I was surprised because I just didn't think that she would really come out with anything like that um, anytime soon. But she did. Um, am I mad about it? I love the song. And I honestly haven't, I don't listen to her music all the time anymore as I did. I do, like, I don't know. I just haven't been listening to it like that. Like, the album was great. But, you know, I was just like, I don't know so i watched it and i was like okay like it was cute like she did her thing but i don't know if like is, she, is that what she's releasing it did like i don't know so i'm gonna we're gonna find out together because not only did i not expect her to release music bitch the shit was leaked i said ma'am y'all just really leaking those with stuff like that like that's crazy but whatever okay my lashes are on i'm feeling more pretty and screen recording is on so we're gonna get in gonna get into it i know this is such a bad camera angle but whatever 
When I saw the leaked version the other day, what was it, yesterday? I don't know, the day before. I'm living for this look. She looks very good in this video. And I see that there's already different edits in here, like the plants and stuff. So that was probably obviously like the unedited version that was leaked, but. so cute too like i can't deny it. like that outfit is so cute she looks really good in this video that's cute her in the cartoon version that's cute I started looking it up on Twitter when I saw this on Twitter that she was coming out with the video I saw that well I saw that the video was already out first of all because it's like two hours later I did not know that she was releasing it I saw that this was inspired by Taylor Moon Taylor Moon Sailor Moon which is an anime show which I've never watched but the inspo is really cute though I like how they have like an anime version of her I don't know if she's taking after a character in Sailor Moon y'all can let me know because I don't watch that anime show um, but I think that's really cute. Look at you. Just keep the 100 when I throw these hundreds. I hope that your ass come on. Let's go. My good sister has barely an arm. Wait, her leg. Wait, where is it? Where to go? <laughs> i can't lie this video is actually really cute and to see gucci man in this video too i'm happy that he's in the video obviously it's a feature but you know it's cute i wonder when they filmed this actually i don't know i wonder if it was recent or this was done like before this is probably my favorite set of the video the pink and the blue it's really freaking cute or the white with the blue light cute as hell like i really i honestly like i said because i really like the um song i did at a point in time want a music video to come out for it but i did not know what direction the video would have gone in but i think the video was cute um i like how i like the inspiration of the video and like the colors and everything and um i believe in the leaked one down i sound like a bad person like i watched the freaking leaked version but like i was interested i didn't think she was gonna put it out anymore but um i feel like she danced more but like i didn't know that she could dance like i could be tripping like i know in the say so video she did a eh, you know but like i did that and i can't dance but like she could dance like the split like she snapped um but i like the video she it was cute she looked good in it and yeah i'm happy that they actually did come out with a video for this song because i was wondering that because it was one of my favorites i, I honestly at first thought it was really slept on but then it kind of makes sense because it could it's 
probably more deemed to be like a summer song so maybe releasing the video now will gain more traction to the song during the summertime and maybe it'll become more like mainstream like how say so did not maybe not as big do you know what i'm saying um i honestly i've loved this song since it came out and i want to give the song and the music video a nine a ten just because i didn't think that i don't know i didn't know what the hell direction it was gonna go in but i didn't think it would be that one but she looked good it was cute like i said i'm so surprised that she released something but then again i don't know um but yeah like i said you know we can have a small discussion down below please no like negativity but you know we can have a discussion about it um and yeah thank you guys so much for watching this video don't forget to like this video comment down below really your thoughts and opinions and subscribe to my channel and the next few slides there will be organizations to donate to in regards to black lives matter so things such as um the george floyd fund thanks for justice for brianna taylor justice for ahmaud aubrey and um other places as well as well as mental health resources in order to help you get through this time because because i know it's tough like you know um for me to see certain things on the media and stuff like that and to see everything in the injustices that go on it is really tough so i really encourage you if you feel like you need that extra push please check out the mental health resources slide that will be coming up after my outro is done to really help yourself and yeah so thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys are all doing well and staying safe and educating yourselves as much as you can so i love you guys and i'll see you guys in the next one bye Take me to